Barakat Yahweh, Barakat Yahweh Shai, Barakat Yahweh Barashim Yahweh Shai, Barashim Yahweh Karkadash. I want to give double honor to the apostles of the Great Millstone, who rule well and teach well, and I want to say Shalom on my recording for the whole full way. Hey, we in those times, ladies and gentlemen, all right? You so-called Negro, Latinos, and Native American Indians who are the Hebrew Israelites, okay? All right? <clears throat> I want to do a quick little lesson on the RFID microchip because that is the mark of the beast, all right? <clears throat> so you can call it the NFC, you can call it the RFID, all right? Near frequency communication, uh, radio frequency identification, all right? Same thing as a chip, all right? And the white man, Esau, is going to want to put it in you, all right? So this is Revelation 13 and 16. And he calls us all, both small and great, Rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Elon Musk, he got the the, the um, brain chip, all right? Uh, recently, I think I've seen somebody say they beat Elon Musk to uh, a chip or some uh, technology that will help the blind, all right? <clears throat> Before Elon Musk came out with it, all right? But nonetheless, it's all deaf at the end of the day, all right? Uh, type in Google NFC chip for humans. This, this is what it says. What is a NFC chip? I mean, implant. It says an NFC implant is a passive trans transponder that is reads or records data using an active transponder, i.e. a NFC compatible smartphone. The transponder can serve as a storage space for emergency information or to share certain media, all right? <laughs> the media or information, all right, is gonna have your bank account records, all right, it's gonna have your uh, your medical records, gonna hold uh, information as far as uh, your uh, social security, um, and, you know, ways to get in and out of your house and, and to buy and sell, okay? All right? <clears throat> Let, uh, let's see what some of these questions are. It says, are chips being implanted in humans? A human microchip implant is typically an identified integrated circuit device or RFID transponder encased in the silicate sil 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 glass and implanted into the body of a human being. That's the badge of servitude from Esau Eden, man. All right. Now let's hear, look at another question. What are microchips used for in humans? Dr. Weston uh, Kieran has a near field communication microchip in his hand that can be used to store data, store information, his name, address, contact details, anything he puts, he chooses to put on it, on their blood type, allergies, drugs, basic medical information. That was last year. All right. The FDA, the FDA is RFID human harmful to humans. The FDA is not aware of any adverse events associated with the R with the RFID. However, there is a concern about the potential hazard of electric magnetic inter interface to electronic ele electronic medical devices from RFID from RF radio frequency transmitters like RFID. All right, look at this, man. This is your death right here, man. All right, the scripture says it's going to cause them to have a grievous sore. All right, let's see if I can find that. All right, Revelation 16 and 2. And the first went out and poured out his vial upon the earth, and there fell a noisome and grievous sore upon the men which had the mark of the beast and upon which worshiped the image. Are right, you going to receive a grievous sore? So is there the answer to this question? Uh, is there is then is RFID harmful to human? Yes, it is, man. All right, because you can receive death, man. But look at this, man. All right, right here in Vice, it says how I got locked out of my NFC chip implant in my hand. So Esau has the technology to lock you out of it, man, if you don't comply. All right, how I lost and regained control of my microchip implant. Look, man. Don't take this shit, man. Cause you you asking for death for me. How about shit, man? I'm man. All right. So um, don't take it, man. All right. At whatever cost, pray to you. How about shit, man? And he will lead you and guide you to where you need to do and what you need to be saying and what you need to be speaking, man. All right. And avoid it, man. All right. 
pray to you, Abba Shem Yahshai. With that, I'm going to say Shalom.